Hey, how's it going guys and welcome back to yet another Tug Your Ghoul Dark War video and today we have uh, got some pulls to do. Um, I've grinded almost um, 8,000 gems um, and I did get a reward somewhere. I think it was a player reward thing. I think it was one of these. I don't actually know. I think it was like one of these player login Thanksgiving reward pack things. I don't know, I can't quite remember where I got them from, but I did manage to get myself um, a pack of 10 VIP tokens. So I'm not sure where they came from, but they are in here. Um, I've actually got 11 now, okay. Um, but I did get 10 in a bulk together. So I thought, hey, we've got some gems. Let's try and do these 10 draws because the 10 draw, the guaranteed SSR uh, 10 draw is back. Um, at the time we're recording this video, it's only got 92 hours left to go. So it's only got about, it's got about two days. Uh, sorry, not two days. About three and a half days or so. So let us, I'm going to do my one draw. Let's do that one first. Hatch cow. So we've got a couple 10 draws to do on this pull today. Of course, all of the SSRs are in here. So um, I bet there's a chance. The new Hoge is not in here. I can see that. The one that's uh, a top-up reward. Yeah, interesting. Anyways, of course, we will be shooting for the half Kuji Yamori so I can get him up to 5-star. That's one of the main characters that I do still need to get up to 5-star. Um, what the rest stars do I really need? I'm on Dual Blade. I don't own. So getting a copy of him would not be too bad. Mm. Just anybody that I don't have five star would be very helpful. So let's do our first 10 draws using our VIP tickets. And I'm glad it's a Toka's come up so it doesn't actually reveal it straight off the bat. Hachikawa, Toka Rabbit, Yamori, Naki. I'm on Dual Blade. I've noticed it likes to give you the characters you don't own. So there's the Amandol. Like, look at all these 30 shards that we just got in there. So there we go. We've got Amandol Blade, which we'll have a look at here in just a second. Where is it? So there is obviously all the new characters that we don't own, but I don't know if they're all in the banner. I don't think they are, if I'm being completely honest. So the chances of getting Toka Summerfest is probably quite high. Um. Yeah, I think out of all the new ones, the only one I've seen available at the moment is the new Hoji, which is a top-up reward, which I don't really like it when they do top-up rewards. But there's the Amon Dual Blade that I really want to use, actually. So we will be using him at some point today. Um, I will obviously... Well, I say some point today. Depends whether or not I can level all his uh, skills and whatnot up. Maybe in today's video, I don't know. Maybe we'll do a video just dedicated to Amon Dual Blade because I have obviously been grinding. I've got my Shinohara up to level 65. The new Shinohara um, up to plus three purple. Uh, once I get him to gold, I'll probably try and do a video on him, but he's not quite there. Just not quite there. Um, but we're not too far away with him. Uh, it looks like I got myself a mastery, obviously, for unlocking him. So let's go in and let's do our next one. So Amon Dojima is hiding what our red is. Takizawa, Hachikawa, Shinohara Armor, which I don't mind getting. Shinohara Arita. I think, I think that's not too bad. It's not what I want, but if I check, in my collection. I think he's only four star. I think this this actually gets him to five star. No, it doesn't. Wow, I thought I had a lot more shards for you than I did. Wow. Never mind then. I thought I was a lot closer, but at least I've checked. Next the VIP draw. I think we've got one more to do after this. Connicate Summerfest. I didn't want that one. Take Hakuro, oh, Take, Konaki, Summerfest. I have already got Summerfest, Konaki, and we got all rares. Wow. 
Let's do another one. I'm on dual blade again, so I got a duplicate of him, so I can definitely get him up to four star. I can definitely get him up to four star. Having a duplicate of Amon Dual Blade. Which, obviously, I, if I want to show him off properly, I want to get him to five star before I, you know, do a video like, oh my god, this guy is so good. You get what I'm saying. You get what I'm saying. Um, I don't have enough. I don't think I... There's nothing I can collect to obviously get enough to do another one right now. Um, of course, I will keep this video going. I'll grind up the next set of gems, which will probably be tomorrow. It's only... 500 gems I can do another pull so yeah this video should go out the day that I've actually recorded this if all things go to plan fingers crossed um but yeah let me have a look so where's my dual blade because I can definitely get him I can star him up for definite there we go so he's now four star any duplicates of I'm on dual blade will help because then I can do the video because obviously he does his uh, avoid control effect and all of that good stuff with crit. So he's going to be one to actually play around with. Obviously when the opportunity arises for me to do so. Because there's a lot of characters in the game at the moment that are really good. And I really want to try. Um, I'm also... Some people are asking me to do some SR uh, to SSR awakenings. I'm still trying to... As you can see, it's really difficult to get these... Um, you know the nutrients that you need to upgrade them it's really difficult actually like look i got a one in five there and it's not always guaranteed so it does require a lot of time to actually get these materials i will put these through like that time i didn't even get any and it's 50 because it's using the hard steps it's a lot it's a lot to actually get them to upgrade so Still got a little bit of work to obviously get. Kisha Arima is probably going to be the first one I do. It just takes a little bit of, you know, grind to actually get that going. A little bit of a grind. But I'll try and level up um, the new Amon Dual Blade and get him up to... I like to do them at gold, like get him to gold and then do a video. Um, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to probably do that with a lot of them because Yoshimura Owl, I really like... Probably one of the better DPS characters in the game at the moment. And I'm out of uh, red syringes. Oh. I'm out of the DPS ones. Well, I'm going to have to do some grinding. But we'll be back tomorrow. And we will finish up this video. So I'll see you guys all then. Okay, guys. Welcome back. And never mind. I was going to do this tomorrow. But I forgot how stupidly broken this uh, new feeding ground is. You get like two, 300 gems just for defeating someone. And climbing the ladder. So. Doesn't bother me. I will take your free gems. I just got 237 gems. So it gave me enough. Um, so yeah. Here we are. Where is it? There we go. Let's do ourselves another 10 draw. Now in between the episodes. Um, Tatra. Joys. Um, in between the episode. I did get two uh, VIP cards. As rewards for doing the other uh, draws. Um. Uh, I did get Toka Summer Fest. I did not expect it off just two cards. We did get Tartra there, which is whatever. I can obviously uh, use those. I don't really... Oh, I do have enough. Let's get his fame up. Um, ultimate Solid. So he gets Physical Defense and Magic Defense plus one. Um, yeah, I, didn't, I never actually leveled up my Tartra. Tartra now actually has... A, the new slot for the the mask thing. Um, I'll show you that in a moment, actually. Um, I think I can do it through... Let's just put... I think Ix has got one, actually. So if I... Ix has got this new slot. So this item you can buy from the feeding ground. Um, I'm going to do a video on it once... Uh, oh, that's not the right character. Uh, I'm going to do a video on it once we uh, unlock it. But... Currently, I just haven't unlocked it. I haven't got enough points. It's in here. You've got to... Here you go. So you've got the mask. You've got all of these different things. Well, the, these six ones are the other ones in the game at the moment. I'm assuming they're going to add more as more updates come out for you to grind away at. Um, but, you know, you've got the Ixa thing here, which costs 10,000. I've only got 6,000 at the moment. So once I get it, we'll have a look at it. We'll do a video on it. We'll have a see what it looks like. 
Um, I think it's got a level system, so you can max it up to, I think it's up to five, so like five star. Um, and it obviously, it's going to give him a boost in some way, so that's something else I can look at as well. Um, but as you can see, I'm only getting 31 of those coins per hour. So it's going to take a long time for me to grind those points up. Obviously, the more you win, the more that number increases. You can't actually see it. It's underneath my uh, webcam. Um, but I'm getting 31 per hour currently. They just accumulate as I'm offline and whatnot. And then I come on and claim them. Um, it's, just a, it's just a waiting game with this feeding ground battle. It's very good. I would recommend doing it, though, because you do get um, all your rewards for... Like the gem rewards, like I was saying, you get about 300 gems per win, depending on how much you're ranking. So that is always nice. Um, but like I said, yeah, I did get Toka Summerfest in here as well. As we can scroll down and we'll see it. There we go. Toka Summerfest, which I did unlock. Um, another character that I didn't own. So currently, the only characters I don't own are all the new ones. All of the new ones, apart from the Shinohara, because that's the only one that's been accessible at the moment. And... Um, the Hoji Chishi is also available, but it's only available on a cumulative top up. And I don't really want to top up, like, I think it's $10 a day. Yeah, I don't really want to be topping up $10 a day just to get a character when it's going to be available at some point soon anyway. Um, especially since it's a week's worth of $10. That's $70 for a character. It's madness. I wouldn't personally do it, just because I'm not mega rich and could throw money into catch games as much as I want, but hey. Um, but yes, uh, I don't know. I don't know why they've chose to do it as a top-up event. And this runs out, actually, in a couple of days, so I'm not sure. Not sure. But anyways, that is going to be today's video. Um, I'm going to, again, keep on the grind, try and get those SSI Awakenings. Um, there are some uh, brand new um, some brand new codes which I have been given. Um, I'm probably going to start using those very, very soon. Um, but for the time being, I'm still trying to... See, this is where I got my two things from. Um, the Diamond Draw Rewards. I'm going to use these old codes. I want to try and get all these old codes used so I can start using the new batch. So there's three new codes that I'll appear on screen for you guys. Um, of course, same order as always. Uh, the first one is the oldest codes that I have and I've not got very many left of. Um, you can only reclaim them once. So make sure you... Uh, if it comes up and it says you've already redeemed, that's why. Or it might have already been redeemed by someone else. It's first come, first serve, as always. Um, you're just trying to find the last letter of this code. So where there's the underscore, that is a blank. You've got to find it from one of the 26 letters of the alphabet. Well, that is going to be it for me. Hopefully you've enjoyed. I will catch you guys in another video of Tokyo Ghoul Dark War. See you guys all next time.